greetings citizens of humanity. We are anonymous, the world is about to see a wave of new likely MARP style ransomware attacks that could potentially target sensitive infrastructure like hospitals or chemical plants, Germany's cyber security agency BSI warns. We strongly believe that ransomware attacks will not decrease in the near future, BSI specialist Dirk Heger told Germany's D-Side newspaper. Criminals have found new ways of extorting money from their victims by encrypting companies' sensitive data and demanding ransom for it, hinting these attacks will be increasingly prevalent in the near future. He added, Arne Schoenbaum, the head of the German Federal Office for Information Security, compared the practices to the protection rackets used by the MARP, in which the rule was, if you don't pay me I'll devastate your business, adding it will be similar in the digital world, though it will not be about physical property, but data. The COVID-19 pandemic will likely make the situation worse. BSI agency warns, explaining the lockdowns forced many companies to allow employees to work from home, reducing their corporate security to the level of home computers, which is not always up to industry standards. We recently conducted a survey of small and medium-sized companies who let their staff work from home. Around the quarter of the companies said they had to deal with serious cyber attacks or even attacks threatening their very existence. Sean Baum continued, the cyber security specialists also stated that pretty much anyone can become the target since the criminals do not pick their victims in advance. They simply look for cyber security holes they can exploit without caring too much about the nature of the organization they are targeting. However, BSI believes massive attacks on critical infrastructure like the one on the United States Colonial Pipeline that led to a gasoline crisis on the East Coast are unlikely to become frequent, not least because it is not beneficial for the criminals. Schoenbaum said to the perpetrators try to stay under the radar of the security authorities. If you attack critical infrastructure, it is only a matter of time before the investigative authorities take action. The officials from BSI stated later, the cybersecurity authorities will hardly be able to deal with the issue anytime soon. It's like the Hydra cut off one head and others emerge. They also criticized the fact that many companies are too slow in fixing cybersecurity gaps. The vulnerability in the Microsoft Exchange server initially affected 65,000 servers in Germany. Two weeks ago, it was still around 4,000 that did not fix the issue. It is very risky these companies are completely unprotected. He continued, at least we don't have to worry about a cyber attack causing a nuclear apocalypse. If it targets a nuclear power plant, BSI specialists believe the plant's control systems were developed in the 1980s and are not as vulnerable to modern hacking attempts simply because they are too old. They are hardly digitized. Hacking a nuclear power plant? No, that's not the danger. Chemical plants, on the other hand, are a different matter, since an attack could disrupt the work of the pumps. However, they are pretty well secured. Hospitals face a much more acute threat, the Germany Cyber C30 had added. Medical facilities in various German states were attacked in 2016, 2019, and 2020, and therefore BSI is currently working on industry-specific security standards, along with the German Hospital Association, though it will take time to implement it in practice. In September 2020, one such ransomware attack on Germany's University Hospital of Dusseldorf resulted in the death of a patient, as doctors tried to transfer her to another facility after the computers in the facility were disabled by hackers. One of the latest high-profile attacks on medical facilities targeted Ireland's health service and forced it to temporarily shut down all of its IT systems earlier in May. As a result, one of Europe's busiest maternity hospitals was bad affected and had to cancel most appointments. We are anonymous. There is no profit motive behind this. We can only speculate that intel agencies are conducting cyber warfare. We are legends. We do not forgive. We do not forget. Expect us.